Who are the good dogs? Huh? Bella! Oh. This is ridiculous for me to do this at this point in any training with her. Oh, hello. You don't keep trying. and You don't say it unless you know, like, 99% certain she's going to respond. I just... She's been so good in the last few sessions, that I, but the distraction level just ratcheted its way, way up. So, you, you, you know, you'd want them to be in here a while before you call them. Oh, look at the, look at the fence line. Okay, Polly's coming in in a while. So, Missy, you're going in Crete. Uh-huh. And I may put you in because if it's raining, he's going to have to come in. But I know that you two will do exceptionally well together. <laughs> and she'll be the boss. So... And, and uh, Polly will not be a threat to her, so it'll be good for her to be around another dog, living with that dog, puppy. And uh, nobody's going to challenge her. So, it's usually good just one female in a, in, in a pack, you know, because they just try to get rid of the other females. That's why when two female dogs fight, uh, you know, well, everything I've read is that it's to the death. It's, it's like, but I get it, because that's how females' dogs think. Get rid of the other females. Then he'll choose me. <laughs> so that's what they do. Also, it's like they they have to be equal. They have to be worthy of... of him and to be superior in, her, in their skills so you know showing their aggression towards any other females might I guess be valued so that's the deal <laughs>